This is just some butternut squash. I kind of like when I handle a butternut squash, unless it's really big, this is a pretty big one. But I just like lop the top yep, off and then like the seedy part, I'm like, eh, you know, like I don't always use it to be honest. But um, so this is like a great um, like orange. First of all, we love the color orange. Yep. Um, it's sweet. And then we're going to put it with um, uh, pepper deli that is a whole wheat pasta and broccoli rob. Beautiful. So we have like. So you, you get know, a little attitude from the broccoli rob. Right? You get sweetness from this, and and you don't have to feel bad about eating the pasta because you're actually eating tons of protein and fiber because it's whole wheat. Right. Pasta deli. And then we finish the whole thing up with uh, a little bit of toasted pumpkin seeds. Yeah, and I have eaten half of the bowl of her pepitas, so she has a few less of those now. I love that. All right, they're good. <laughs> you throw them in so, the oven? Yeah. Toss those in. And you know what? There's some in there already roasting, if you could grab those as sure, well. Sure, I shall. Thank you. So, all right, so we have our pasta water, but we're going to multitask this guy. We're going to use it to blanch our broccoli rabe Great. and then cook our pasta right in that same water. Plenty of salt. Plenty of salt in your water. Salty like the ocean. That's salty like the ocean. Perfect. Season the water itself, guys. Yes. That's the only chance you get to flavor the pasta itself. And then broccoli rabe in. I've taken the super woody stems right off. Um, All those great leafy greens. It's so good for you. Right? Broccoli rabe, I have to say, is one uh, of my favorite vegetables. One of my absolute favorite things in the world. Is it on height? Yeah, they got yeah, you on Sure is. And so, like, it's just a quick, like, in and Oh, my gosh. It's an innie outie. It's an innie outie. Just to kind of... <laughs> well, okay, okay, a mind out of the gutter. It's a cooking show. You said it. Uh, <laughs> well, they were thinking it. They started laughing. <laughs> but it's like, hi, because I'm Amberelle and I'm inappropriate. Inappropriate. Right? Um, we've heard that before, too. All right, so then, um, so broccoli rabe in and out. It basically cooks the broccoli rabe, and it also takes a little of the bitter right out. It takes out. a little of the edge off, right? Right. So then we have our pappardelle, whole wheat pasta Big right in there. Noodles. You love those guys? I do love them. Then we do this. Oh, that's the love. So in so our good. oil with a little bit of Chili fresh flakes. red pepper. And mm. we just do this until the oil is perfumed. Oh, smells good. And then we take it out because it's fulfilled its garlic destiny. Right. So it's fulfilled its garlic destiny. It does. They were like, you know, we brown you it. The, you got so the flavor in there. Perfume the oil, but we have like garlic rather than garlic. It's yeah. garlic. Um, so like everyone works together to bring uh, equal amounts to this party. Um, so look at, there we go. It's this so is good. like a chef facial right there. Mm -hmm. Makes mm. me happy as a vongole. All right, so. Happy as a vongole. Happy that's as an a clam. A, that's an Italian <laughs> clam. Right, okay, then we take these guys out. Thank you for coming. And then when we're like, <laughs> broccoli rob right in there. Woo! Like this is, I love this dish because it's so seasonally appropriate. It's delicious. It's colorful, it's easy, it's so filled with great nutrition. Good for you, and like everyone likes all this stuff. You know, it's super yeah. fresh. Um, so broccoli rob in there. Butternut squash. Yummy, yum. All right, and then we're just gonna toss these guys all around. All right, mm, look at, already I'm like, ooh, aren't you good looking? Aren't you a good looking dish? <laughs> right? um, all right, so pasta's just gonna cook for another sec. I'm and gonna bring all this stuff up. down to all you right. so we don't have to walk a mile to get to the dishes. All right, perfect. All right, we're just about ready here. Do you have a, like a ladle or a spoon? Guys, you got a ladle? Or, hey, give me a mug. You want it for the, the just water? Just put a little pasta water in my... Can I have like... a mug? <laughs> They'll come. Hi. 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 Yay! <laughs> that was Grant. I wish I could do that in my regular life, just to be like, I, know, I right? need this. And in have someone like, run it up to me all the time. That would There's be like... no more clean mopines! And then, boom, they magically appear. Right? I know. It's like right. we have Keebler elves back there or something. It's real right. fun. Perfect. <laughs> all right. So we just toss all these guys together, and then we perform the marriage of the pasta and the sauce, which is like yum, one of yum. my favorite things to do. We finish it with big fat finishing oil, a little bit of Parmigiano, and there we go. We're like, woo, look at this. Some yeah. cheese in there, babe? Cheese me up, buttercup. Mm. Ugh, you know what they say, it's not easy being cheesy. <laughs> All right, there we go. You know, I could be a vegetarian easily, but I don't think I could do the vegan thing because of the cheese thing. The cheese I gotta thing, have the cheese and thing. I need, yeah, you know. Yeah. I need an egg in my life, too. Yeah. I'm, a, I'm an egg girl. Eggy cheesy. <laughs> right, okay, and then finish me up. This is where we set the perfect texture of everything. Look at this. Oh, it's just what I'm looking for.